टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस सेंट्रल फॉरवर्ड इंटरपोलेशन सो द गिवन प्रॉब्लम इज एक्स वैल्यू इज वन टू थ्री फोर फोर वन टू थ्री फोर एंड एफ ऑफ एक्स इज वन एट ट्वेंटी सेवन सिक्सटी फोर फाइंड एफ ऑफ टू पॉइंट फाइव यूजिंग सेंट्रल फॉरवर्ड इंटरपोलेशन सो द एक्स एंड वाई वैल्यूज आई एम रिप्रेजेंटिंग कॉलम वाइज नेक्स्ट वी हैव टू फाइंड आउट द फर्स्ट डिफरेंसेस एट माइनस वन सेवन नेक्स्ट ट्वेंटी सेवन माइनस एट नाइनटीन नेक्स्ट सिक्सटी फोर माइनस ट्वेंटी सेवन इट इज थर्टी सेवन सिमिलरली सेकेंड डिफरेंसेस नाइनटीन माइनस सेवन ट्वेल्व एंड थर्टी सेवन माइनस नाइनटीन इट इज एटीन सिमिलरली थर्ड डिफरेंस इज एटीन माइनस ट्वेल्व सिक्स नेक्स्ट द फार्मूला फॉर सेंट्रल फॉरवर्ड इंटरपोलेशन इज वाई नाट प्लस पी डेल्टा वाई हाफ P into P minus one by two factorial into delta square y naught so on so forth. How you have to remember the central forward interpolation formula is first you come across with y notation. Let us consider y naught delta y half delta square y naught delta q y half delta power four y naught. Let us look at the p notation. Starting with p, forward means always. You go start with an subtraction p into p minus one. Next, this p into p minus one always you have to write here. Next, you have to get p plus one. So the next term is this entire one you have to write here p into p minus one into p plus one. Last is p plus one. Therefore, next you have to get it as the subtraction that is p minus two. P minus one already there. P minus two. Okay. The p formula for forward interpolation is x minus x naught by h. X stands for 2.5, and x naught is not one. X naught you don't consider as one. Here we have to draw a central line. Okay. So 2.5 lies where it lies between two and three. Therefore. With using two, you draw a central line. This central line, how you have to draw the central line means it it touches the points x naught, y naught, delta square y naught, and delta power four y naught. It should go through like this. Then these values, this you call it as x naught. The corresponding value eight as y naught, and this one is you call it as the delta y half. This you call it as the delta of square y naught. This you call it as the delta q y half. Okay. So therefore, p x minus x naught x is two point five. X naught is two. H is equal to one. The difference between these x values. Therefore, p is zero point five, and y naught is eight, and this delta y half delta square y naught delta q y half. so therefore for forward triangle for central forward interpolation this is a lower triangle you have to consider the lower triangle for forward interpolation okay so the formula is this is the one for central forward interpolation y not y not is 8 substitute y not p 0.5 delta y half 19 and go on substituting here you are going to get as f of 2.5 as 15.625 f of 2.5 is 15.625 thank you